Hello everyone, and this time we're going to make a quick clear type text tutorial. Now you often see these on adverts or on leaflets where they're trying to draw your attention. So you start with your original picture, in this case we've got York Minster. And what you want to do is duplicate the background layer and then blur it a bit. that, perhaps a bit more, six or seven will do. Then I want to increase the brightness slightly. Now you could use the curves and create an adjustment layer, but because it's a separate layer altogether I'm just going to go and destructively edit the image and when I say curves I mean curves not levels. And there we go, that's enough and create a new layer get your default colors by pressing D aka black and white and type in clear text that's of course way too big shift home bring it down don't really like that font bring it down again Now what we want is that text to be the original picture below. So you go to your edited layer and create a new mask which shows everything. Go back to your top layer which is your clear text and make sure sample all layers and contiguous are unticked but make sure anti-alias is ticked. Click anywhere on the text. Then go onto your mask, make sure it's not the layer itself but it's the mask of the layer. Go onto your brush tool, make sure you're painting with black and draw over or paint over your selection. Now you won't see any difference because we've got this top layer selected so we unselect that and there now is your clear text layer. So you're thinking, hmm, that's it. So to make it more of a change, because now we've got the two separate layers, you click on your top layer and make any adjustments to that top layer you want and the clear text, because it's on a mask, will stay the same. So image adjustments, let's get the curve and increase it more. And I think the background would look slightly better if it was slightly blurred so let's go to the Gaussian blur and perhaps not six but maybe two and there we go there's your clear text tutorial hope you enjoyed this one